Hello everyone, I don't mind admitting, this is one of my favourite cities anywhere in the world. Seville, we're close to the centre at the Estadio Ramon Sanchez Pituan. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And really looking forward to starting this new year with some live football for you. It's Sevilla taking on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And this is how Sevilla will line up. Yasin Bounou is the goalkeeper. Marcos Acuna plays with Jesus Navas in the fullback positions. Ivan Rakitic plays alongside Fernando in the centre of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide and operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. should tell us an awful lot and it's Sevilla who get the match started Rakitic perfect tackle and he might be through here surely and a goal it is no long wait for the opener today Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Heel. Vinicius Jr. It should be! Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Heel. Yusuf and Nesiri. And he has options available. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And showing fine vision. Just not testing the keeper at all with that cross. And Nesiri. Shot attempted. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. A concession of a corner here. Going short. Rakitic gives it a go determined defending Rodrigo on to Benzema and tidily played promising attack but his timing was off
and Nasiri. Ocampos. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Keeper not concentrating. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Sure, it didn't get past him. Ocampos. Here's Fernando. Yusuf and Nesiri. And fed forwards. And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, over the last 15 minutes, Sevilla have really started to take control and they've created chances. It just now needs one of those chances to be taken, but you feel it's coming. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And you don't want to lose possession there. Well, fantastic reflex action. Fired over by Kors. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. <laughs> to make it 2-0. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Over the touchline for what will be a Real Madrid throw. And since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Nicely timed tackle. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Eduardo Camavinga is with Vinicius Junior Benzema the ball with Luka Modric and the emphasis is on creativity easy save David Alaba. The ball with Luka Modric. Oh, this is looking promising. Carvajal. Now with Benzema. Oh, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. So nearly at half time, and the home side trailing, albeit not by much. Stuart, your thoughts up to this point? Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Heel. Oh, 
Rakitic. Well, the supporters think it's on. And a chance to level it. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And that's going to bring the first half action to an end here at the Estadio Ramon Sanchez Pituan. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Second half underway with Real looking to build upon a positive first half showing. Delivering it into the box. Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. Corner to Real as they try to press home their advantage. Taken short. Vinicius Jr. Terrific block. Tony Kroos. Benzema takes it forward now. Able to skip past his man. Well then there to tidy up. He has teammates around him. Is this the moment? And the keeper diving to thwart him. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Cross with the corner. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. <laughs> Lucas Ocampos. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. And good pressure high up the pitch. Gomez. Being egged on by the crowd. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Recordamos que a la salida del estadio podrán recoger un pequeño obsequio de parte del club para agradecerles su inestimable apoyo. Corner kick played in. Well, threat over for now. Camavinga. The ball with Luka Modric. Vinicius Jr. Poor pass under no real pressure. Gives it a go. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Substitution for Real Madrid. And there's the delivery. Well, it has come to nothing. Lucas Ocampos. It's Torres now. Can he take the chance? The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Tony Kroos. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, he's given it away. 
Promising attack, this. Lucas Ocampos. It's Torres now. Can he find the net? Oh, it's an unbelievable save by Courtois. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. And now the delivery. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Elects to go short. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Many Federico Valverde Benzema and now Rodrigo just cutting off the supply well, a bit of an unforced error and it's going to be a throw Rakitic, Lucas Ocampos, just the challenge that was required, that's a lovely ball, Vinicius, and with that the attack fizzles out. Well, I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game, but there's still time to find that equaliser. And you have to say the crowd have been brilliant. They're still driving the team on. Modric moving into the advanced position. Real chance! Oh dear, not a great effort, was it? Substitution time it is here. Well, not hard to read that pass. Might really be able to trouble them here. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Well, what can you say about this? It's hit so cleanly with exactly the right amount of bend on it. And he does so well to get it back down in time once it goes over the wall. Excellent strike. So 2-0 now. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. In with a chance. In it goes. But it will not stand. Offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now.
Rakitic. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the board in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. Luka Modric tends to bring a calm authority to any game. How would you sum up what he produced? Well, he should be happy with his goal and the win, but he'd be slightly annoyed that he hasn't scored a couple more. Overall, though, I thought he was excellent.